Oh, he's got a. Oh, I have no hat. God I'm damn it. Word, Courtney. That's okay, Jack. Does he just you, you hang out permanently in front of a high school or something? <laughs> what is this place? Yeah, where was he? What is this? The is this a college? Fund. What are you talking about? I guess don't it might be a can college Courtney. campus. Jack, I swear, I don't know what you're talking about. How Shut up, Courtney. Here is one of the investors in the suburban redevelopment fund. You're out of your mind. I was down at the Hall of Records checking on a property company called Elysian Fields Developments. Their funding comes from the Suburban Redevelopment Fund. Seriously, Jack, I have no idea. Your name is there, Courtney, with some pretty interesting company. The mayor, the district attorney, some dirty cops, and your buddy, Dr. Harlan Fontaine. Mm, his good buddy. Dr. Fontaine? Spill it, Courtney. I want all of it. Fontaine and the rest. Do you actually get to question him? This is a cutscene, I think. Fontaine took the morphine off our hands. Look, Jack, I know you said to get rid of it, but it's okay. I did something good for once. He reinvested the money. For so he just like used his name? It. Yeah. I guess. Okay. Happening. They're building houses for GIs, Jack. I turned a mistake into something beneficial. You've Something been had, Sheldon. The guys. Courtney, no. They're matchstick houses. They're going to burn them for the insurance money. They'll probably stiff the poor bastards for the deposits. Oh, they even lose their deposits? Oh, no. Oh, that's so bad. That's no. extra bad. Oh. Now, that, that's extra relatable to people like us. Good now, we're very angry. A lot of oh, no. Looks like he's helping himself, Courtney. You're the fall guy. Wow, and you even pushed him in the chest. Now he was hoping life. that he would fall over to be, to illustrate his point, but he didn't. <laughs> <laughs> he does like a judo fall, like trip to make him fall. And you're the fall guy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's just walking on his own. Oh, I love this look without the jacket. Oh, uh, it looks good. Badass. Oh, I like good it. Good holster. Although I'll admit, I never love that suspender um, uh, design that has like those little splits at the end. The way oh, he's got. Oh yeah, yeah. Well, I, I'm good with it. Um, where's the oh, phone here? Oh, you patient. Jack Galso. Moshi mosh. Mosh <laughs> mosh. <laughs> That's how you answer. You get around I was in Japan. I bet you would, Mr. Monroe. But I value my skin highly enough to not want to meet with you. Look at this noir call. Mm -hmm. <laughs> have a nice cup of tea. You realize that I can make you a very wealthy man, Mr. Kelso. But we have this red evil oh, office. He got, a, he got he got a raise, two twenty a month. That's nice. pretty good. Oh, good All job. Right. Good job. Substantially better. I'm going to have to let it slide, Mr. Monroe. Are you haggling with me, Jack? I might be. Come around to my place at nine. 5164 Santa Monica Boulevard. You'll come? I might. So 220 a month is more like 2600 a month. Okay. So it's that's, better. So that that's that's it's much better. It's like maybe $31,000 a month. They're about or a year. Yeah, 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 yeah. A, a year, a year. Which is better? Yeah. Now in LA, that's unsurvivable. <laughs> oh no, you cannot get by with that amount of money in yeah. LA on your You're, own. You'll die. <laughs> that much money. Meats! Ah, oh, it's like Arby's. Oh, which are my... Which is, which is my car? The blue one. Yeah, but why is there two cars here? Ooh. Well, there's a blue one. Where are yours? I'm gonna do this one. Get in that blue car with the, with the little... Leland Monroe's mansion. And those little chrome stripies on it. So let's go meet Mr. Monroe. Ah! That cop was like, ah, good old Jack. <laughs> yep. Man about town, that Kelso. Oh, Jesus, what are you doing? Hang on. Hang on, everybody. Jack's so restless. I mean, so reckless. <laughs> Rest restlessly reckless. Reckless in Seattle. <laughs> That's the sequel. 
What's funny is that it wasn't even restless in Seattle. It was yeah, it was sleepless. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but the, it's a trilogy. Uh, oh, okay. uh, uh, sleepless in Seattle, restless, restless in, Seattle, in Seattle, reckless in Seattle. <laughs> <laughs> it's like how they wanted to do that stupid Unbreakable trilogy. Unbreakable. And then the prequel's like coma in Seattle. <laughs> Like, 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 did you hear that, 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 the original trilogy Bruce Willis thought M. Night Shyamalan wanted to make? No, I don't remember hearing the actual The plan. names were supposed to be Unbreakable, Breakable, Broken. <laughs> <laughs> broken. Imagine you're watching that one. What is that? You just in a hospital? The whole yeah. Time? <laughs> the Mr. Glass comes in and is like, what did I tell you? Look at you now, <laughs> broken, <laughs> like me. <Yeah. laughs> oh, man. Get on the teacups ride, Bruce. <laughs> It'll be fun. Uh. Have you met my new friend, Professor Xavier? <laughs> okay. This looks ridiculous. We can reminisce later. I want a minimum of noise. Wait, who did he call together? Are these old army boys? Mm -hmm. All, all of his army friends. That's what they do for army boys. Jack, we all feel the same way. Just hasn't turned out quite the way we imagined. Let's get it done. Teams of two at the ready. So uh, Jack doesn't do talks. Uh, Jack fucking storms mansions. <laughs> mm hmm. Yeah, this is just like storming like an estate. Jack an estate that has like patrolling gangsters in the hedge maze or in the gardens. Jack don't give a fuck. Like you know you're evil when you need to have gangsters patrolling your garden, like constantly at night. Yeah. All the yeah, time. Yeah. Exactly. Like as a rule. When you need to organize shifts for your gangsters patrolling your garden, you'll know you've made it as an evil villain. Can I get my hat back? Nope, not no. yet. No. Okay, I might not be able to get my hat back. I need to cease fire, I think. Man, your men are, your men are doing it. Oh, that's a friend. Okay. Really hard to tell. <laughs> it really is. <laughs> Just bumping into people who are currently shooting. Pop your head out. Pop your head out. Come on. Uh. Alright, you can advance now. Oh wow, you could shoot the horse down. <laughs> yeah, take that horse. Take that, you equine. <laughs> you equine son of a bitch. Oh, hold Someone on. else said son of a bitch. Uh oh. You're on the verge of death. Oh, Looking fell. a little pale, Jack. Jack Kelso, don't give a fuck. Oh no! You fool! Aww. Oh, I, 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 that happened as soon as I said Jack Kelso, don't give a fuck. Oh, they have a, um, uh, auto save here. Awesome. Courage and cowardice are in every man, Jack. <laughs> <laughs> One day you might shoot your ally, and that's fine. This isn't right. I don't Only think the DA's left. office would want this. <laughs> it's fine. They hired oh, you. They got, they, got what, oh. they got what they paid for. Oh, this is starting to look a little like RE4 over here. A little bit. It's an evil mansion. Yeah, it's evil mansion. We're the dogs. Right, man, hold the perimeter. 
I got personal business. Man, we just fucking tore through the place. <laughs> yeah, what's that? What's that glowing thing off to the side there? Oh, glowing thing. Uh, yeah. See that light? Oh, I think it's just a light. Just a light. It'd Weird. be a light. I don't like that. He has lights lighting up his house at night. Okay. Oh, there's the door that I can open. These two Ooh, doors they, I can't open, but this They could even have, like, fancy evil meetings outside. Walk out of here, go out. All right. Wow. All right. It's a good thing you have all this ammo on you. Yeah, let's do this. Pow! Oh, it's going back out. Wait. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> hang on, hang on. You got turned upside down and flipped. I wish I could take one of these spears. Yeah. <laughs> run, run at Leland with it. Yeah. So the next newspaper is in his office, you said? Yeah. On the end of his desk. Put the weapon down, now! I say after I shot him. <laughs> he has a skull in a display case. Wow. You're a very sweet looking girl to be holding such a big gun. I know how to use it, mister. I'm sure you do. So how about pointing it over there in the direction of Hollywood instead of a yeah, Fuck Hollywood. <laughs> Hollywood. <laughs> I don't normally shoot women, princess. How about putting the cannon down? Ah. ah. Oh. <laughs> but I'll hit a woman. As I'll punch her good. As was the style at the time. I'll do it anytime. <laughs> oh, it got him right in the, the elbow really pit, too. One. Yeah, that's it doesn't a bad look good place for to him. get shot. Oh. Monroe, where are you, damn it? And that's your shooting hand. Or that, that's your shooting arm. Yeah. Well, no, his shooting arm's his left arm. Or his right arm. His left arm. Oh, I thought he was shot in his right arm. My bad. Okay, well. Oh, it's more fighting. Man, Monroe's estate's pretty crazy. My hat? Who knew that he had such an evil lair? There we go. Whew. I want to meet Monroe without my hat. It's unbecoming. Uh, it's like the Beauty and the Beast staircase. <laughs> Monroe is the beast. Oh, I see you. I see you. I see Did you know that the Beauty and the Beast, like, Tale as Old as Time song, like, yeah. any lyric in that song can be replaced with another lyric from the same song because they were all written with exactly the same number of syllables? Yeah. They, uh, they wrote it, uh... So you can remix it however you like. Learning you were wrong. Learning you were wrong. <laughs> Then somebody bends. God damn it, my Learning hat. you were wrong. Unexpectedly. There we go. Oof. He likes blue. He's got a blue hat, blue car. I like the cut of his jib. Yeah. I like blue a lot, too. I usually select blue in all my personal colors. Your personal endeavors. Where's it's fucking true. Monroe? In fact, the Fugitive Games logo is blue. It's true. Monroe. Right, none of these doors are openable, I think. Uh, hmm. Follow the light. Well, I did before, and this was the light. Really? And then I went through here, and this is a bathroom. Um. Oh, uh -huh. oh. There you go. Yeah, go so. Uh, gee. <laughs> In negotiating position. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> you crazy <laughs> son of a bitch. Okay, I really like that. I really like you just <laughs> shot him immediately. Yeah, yeah. I thought I had an invitation, Monroe. Your boys outside were certainly expecting me. Oh my god. Oh, and he oh, came yeah. <laughs> Oh, this is so good. This is so good. 
<laughs> See, he told you, Kelso does <laughs> not give a fuck. He just does whatever he wants. <laughs> then I want you to tell me. What Imagine how fast all of those other cases would have been solved with Kelso running. <laughs> This is good. Oh, that must like be the this. newspaper back there. All right. I like this new attitude. Okay. Suburban Redevelopment Fund promises 10,000 new homes. Construction work <laughs> continues at breakneck pace. Projected costs will had, run into multi-millions. I just had this thought. Like, what? It, you know how sp 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 uh, newspapers would do that spinning effect and, yeah, you know, yeah. all the old time, whatever? What if that's actually what they were doing all the time? <laughs> And you had to keep them under control to, to read them. them. Oh, they're like unruly, <laughs> like sentient things. And you're like, like as oh, soon as you stop. touch it, it starts spinning. It's like, stop, stop. no. Stop. I have to read well, you have to catch like... it. That's how the newsboy throws it at you. It's spinning Ooh. at your face. <laughs> so dangerous. Ah. <laughs> I need to speak with you urgently. Sit down. Please sit down. Tell me about the suburban redevelopment fund. It's the fund we are using. It's the fund. <laughs> it's a fund. It's going to redevelop the suburbs. Technically, you are a major contributor. You provided us morphine. <laughs> it's right there in the documentation. <laughs> Courtney Sheldon. Sheldon provided morphine. Morphine provider. <laughs> Stolen morphine provider. Courtney Sheldon says right here. Jack Kelso. An investigator no, why would you say his name out loud? Oh, no. You fucking idiot. Dude. Oh. Why do you trust this creepy evil doctor so much? I feel that I have been duped. I feel no. that I have been duped. <laughs> Ridiculous. Jack says it's a property developer. Oh, uh, Courtney's so dumb. Look at it. You're as he, dumb as a bag of hammers. Did you not see him open his holding a needle? Oh no! Walking around, Courtney. No. You idiot, Sheldon. Thank you for your trust. Don't let him touch. Oh my God! Ah, 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 ah. No, squirming once the needle's inside you is such a bad idea. It's so bad. Oh, right in your neck too. Go. Oh my ah. god, that's gonna cause some. Oh. Is that a death? Did he just kill him? Drift away. Why did he close that door? Was that the door to his bathroom? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's some hell of a. Like, Jack saw that. He's like, oh my god. <laughs> this evidence <laughs> is crazy. <laughs> Newspaper didn't do that to me ever before. Look at. The suburban. Why <laughs> Remind me what they say about absolute power, Monroe. <laughs> Fuck you, Jack. Ah, this is the stupidest thing in the world. Stay tuned for next week when we release our podcast about a <laughs> suburban redevelopment plan. Oh, what's next? Like, they're all playing cards together and, and uh, fucking Cole Phelps shows up in a costume and says, I threw a rock at him. Like, oh my God. <laughs> Oh, these guys are idiot. Oh my god, these guys have you know, with such impunity. Oh, oh, shotgun collection. Ooh, cool. Can you get at those? No, I can't. It's tantalizing. It is tantalizing. Oh, this brightly lit thing, probably. No, nope, it's not. Okay. Oh man, you can't uh, even get a cigar. Oh, it's probably his desk. Hang on. Really? Sit down and oh man, you can't even sit at his desk and rub it in. Oh, it's a fairly that, wow, small that was desk really considering. Finicky. Okay, um, Sawyer, John Stone, Goldstein, Horelli, Her Steffens. That sounds really familiar. Some sold up. Hmm. The others obviously didn't know the links these sons of bitches would go to. <laughs> I was not sure exactly what all those names were. I think GIs? <laughs> Steffens, that sounds really familiar. Were they all the targets like that owned properties they were trying to get a hold of? Maybe. Well, they said like some of them sold up. Stephens is one of the families I think that burned. Oh, okay, and that would make some sense. Oh, this is, is that this old is like here. strong well, army tactics. This will oh, be a okay. wealth of information. <laughs> wow, that's so well lit. Why is the safe so well lit? Criminal Intelligence Report on Dr. Arlen Fontaine. 
Oh, really? Implicating the supply and distribution of narcotics in the greater LA County area. Oh, interesting. Okay, so they already had a profile on him. Oh, Roy Earl. Keep the dirt on Fontaine under lock and key. This hmm. is oh, Roy wrote this report up for Fontaine in the event they needed, not Fontaine, for um, this guy, uh, insurance, this uh, housing for, guy. For Leland? Yeah, for Leland, so that he'll have leverage against Harlan Fontaine in case Fontaine uh, betrays them. Oh, for a moment, I, for a second, I actually forgot who Roy Earl was. Yeah, Roy Earl, the, thought, the detective, the fucking asshole partner. Yeah, at first I was thinking of um, the drunk guy. Um, oh, he's got some shares as well. I'm guessing Benson's oh, but portfolio it's, is only a fraction. It's of Link. Yours, Monroe. Oh, you, you could do whatever you want, I guess. And then, what is this, a passport? What is this? Oh, it's just a book. Okay. Oh, the payroll. oh, Roy Earl, R. Earl, okay. on the payroll. There you go. Okay. Damn. Who's getting paid eleven hundred dollars and twelve hundred? Um, some major Randlet. players. Okay. These just must. These just must be all the cops on the take in general. Maybe, huh? Are any of them like higher ups that we can recognize? Well, let's see. Um, None of them are chiefs or, or like um, um, Sandler. captains, are we? O'Malley. Was that the name of? I don't think it was O'Malley. No, uh, I don't think it was either. No, but, but, no I don't not recognize. I just recognize. Wait, Earl. there's there's R Earl and then Roy Earl. Oh, he probably just wrote it as R Earl sometimes and then Roy Earl sometimes. That's all. I bet. I guess so. Yeah. Yeah. So I bet it's you that's just a, right it's an ongoing record of every transaction. It can't be stopped, Council. <laughs> There's too much Kingdoms rise and kingdoms fall. Man. Dang. Ask the Emperor of Japan. Oh. Fucking mercy. Operator, put me through to Phelps, arson squad. Yeah, Biggs, it's Jack. I'm oh, he's going to Herschel. Talkative mood. If you get here in a hurry, you might get something before he bleeds to death. <clears throat> Elsa. Oh. Thank God. Where? Elsa. Fontaine. What? Dead? <laughs> Former patient. <laughs> so that crazy son of a bitch finally came back for a checkup. It's Monroe. He's raving. <laughs> you want information, cocksucker. You get me some medical help. <laughs> I gotta go, Herschel. Monroe's negotiating. What a cool guy. Date? Tell me how I find the guy who has Elsa. Not Casey. He, he did whatever Fontaine asked. He, he had some kind of power over him. <laughs> he, he did all the fires and, and then he went off Monroe. the rails. This is amazing that we're not doing the interrogation <laughs> thing. Yeah, it is nice that he you don't have to do that. Freer. That would have been ridiculous. Mm -hmm. be a goddamn doctor. Nah. I'm gonna kick your leg a couple more times. Yeah, just keep kicking him. Why not? What did he grab? What's the worst that could happen? Kelso, you son of a whore! <laughs> <laughs> <I'm dead doctor! laughs> oh, this is a good scene. I'm just crawling over. <laughs> Call a Fontaine over. I'm sure he'll, he'll patch up just fine. Yeah. The psychiatrist. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh, perfect case. I'm a doctor. Wow. How Valorous. Did this oh, five stars. Now, how Ooh. did this leg injury make you feel? <laughs> uh, the Suburban Redevelopment Fund has been dismantled the old-fashioned way. All right. The old-fashioned way is a w bunch of bullets. Yeah, and badassery. Let's shoot bullets out of our guns. <laughs> I'm surprised we haven't said that earlier. Oh, okay. I think I have, but <laughs> I like saying it every so often.